Another reason why people hate change is because not only do they see change as pain, but all they see change is as failure. And it's because every time you've made a change, you have failed. And you have to start identifying change with a new layer of belief. I see change as transformation. I see change as evolution. I see change as beauty, brilliance. I see change as the future. I see change as necessary. I see that if I don't change, there is a generation of people who are gonna be stuck in the same place. If I don't evolve, see those of you who will evolve, who are willing to evolve, you will inherit the future. Those of you who are willing to take everything you do to the next level. It is the individual who is willing to become more than what they have ever been. See, the marketplace rewards those who have evolved. The marketplace rewards those who have become more valuable. You will be rewarded for the pain. Cry in secret, bleed in secret, but in public you'll be rewarded. I want you to start looking back over all the times you made a change and you failed. Confront that pain. See, change is inevitable. And you are either changing for the worse or changing for the better. You decide. People tell me all the time, it's hard to get wealthy. It's hard to grind. It's hard to be focused. How do you even do these speeches? It's hard to stay motivated. It's hard to stay broke. It's hard to stay depressed. It's hard to stay governed by anxiety. It's hard to be inconsistent. It's hard not to have daily disciplines. It's hard not to believe in yourself. It's hard to be poor. It's hard. It's all hard. So choose your heart. You either gonna work for it gonna sit there and let life knock you down and dare you to get back up. So I see the privilege. I see the moment. I see the purpose and the pain. Change is an invitation to the future. If I can change, I can have my future. future. Destiny is calling even now. I want to speak to you from the topic change because many of you listening to me have been beautifully equipped to live in a world that no longer exists. But I want to give you a new word for change and that word is evolution and you are either going to evolve or expire. See, everything changes. The economy changes. Relationships changes. We change mentally and emotionally and physically. I know that when you apply this new word to change, everything transforms in your life. No longer see it as change. As we examine your life, many of you listening to me, everything that came with change left a bad taste in your mouth. Every time you made a change, you got hurt. And so this is why when you hear the word change, there is a mental block. You cannot change because you have equated change with pain. Every time you have changed, you feel pain. You stepped out of one relationship to another and you feel pain. You leave one neighborhood to another and you feel pain. You go from one job to another and you feel the fire of transition. So every time you hear the word change, you see pain. Every time they say it's time to make a difference, every time they say you need to go from this place to that place, all you can see is blood in your eyes, hypnotized by the pain of change. But I want to help you see change differently today. Let's call change evolution. And those who are willing to evolve will inherit the future. See, change is not pain. Evolve your belief system. See change as growth. See change as transformation. See change as evolution. See change as necessary. See change as critical. See change as inevitable. And the more and more you start to see that change is not pain, you're going to see transformation. Your life's going to experience a quantum leap because now your history is not your destiny. 